Hey, so I've just left this run out of AdBlue um, and we'll show you what happens here. So once we get past all these warning messages, I, I have an AdBlue level empty refill to start engine. When we go to start, we just have a no start situation. The car is in park and it won't start because we have no add blue. Okay, under the bonnet here, this is just the battery here. We have a fuse and relay box. There's two tabs up here that you need to press and then this can hinge forward and pull out of the way. Inside here we have a chart with all the different relays. I'm interested in relay number two which if you look at the position, how it sits, relay number two is this one up here. That little number one is referring to a fuse that's deep down in there. Relay number two, I wanna remove this. Now, they are quite tight and you will need to wiggle. This whole thing feels a little bit wobbly, but you need to wiggle it and back and forth, left and right, and that relay comes out. Now that relay has two larger terminals and two smaller terminals. What I'm interested in is these two larger terminals and where they go down into this relay panel here. Okay, so now looking where this relay came out, um, we can see here we've got the two smaller terminals and the two bigger terminals here. These are the two here that we want to bridge. You need to make sure that the car's ignition is turned on, the handbrake is on, and the car is in park because the car will start up regardless of what gear it is in, and you don't want it to move forward. Once we bridge these, the starter mode will be engaged. Um, so you will need to disconnect it once the engine starts. 